probably it has, to, it has to be the James Bond, doesn't it? it has to, there's no other way. He's just the ultimate man. What about James Bond? So kind of wait. Well, he never gets killed for a start. Apart right in the end. No, he's a. Well, he's just. He, everything he does is so smooth. In a tuxedo most of the time, chasing beautiful women, driving fast cars, and drinking some excellent alcohol, and never losing a game of poker, never losing a game he's ever challenged at. Just, I think he's the all-round. He's a superstar. I'm told off for of wearing just t-shirt jeans and flip-flops or trainers. So I keep it very simple all the time. Never dressing up? Well, obviously occasionally I do. Um, but then if someone says smart casual to me, that is, to me would be jeans and a shirt. But then... A blazer a push or you... Well, no, see, that's Straussy. That's what Straussy would wear with a blazer. Um, so, when, so when... But then apparently smart casual is a suit without a tie. So I'm a little bit less than that. So I'm, I do like, I, yeah, I'm very casual, but I do like dressing up and looking smart, but I always think it's a special occasion and you shouldn't overwear it. No, well, I actually really enjoyed today in the, uh, being dressed up. I quite enjoy having the lovely lady tying my shoelaces, that's an sure. optional extra. Um, yeah, it is good, isn't it? I think it looks, it might have changed me a little bit, haven't it? Because I never normally wear ties, so. But, It makes you feel um, more grown. Confident? Yeah, more grown up, doesn't it? More right. proper. When you're all tailored and all fitted well, it looks top drawer. So I might have to go and start investing in some ties and actually completing my outfit because normally I go suit without a tie. So. You're going to be wearing a cummerbund before you know it. <laughs> That's, that is the last, as you know, when you turn into an old man. <laughs> No, definitely Scarlett Hansen. Okay. Definitely. So Katie Harry. Classic. Yeah. Though. I think the out there stuff, no, it's not for me. No imagination, No, I'm definitely simple and stylish, it's far okay. better. I'm simple, but I d if I didn't pluck my eyebrows, I'd have a brilliant mono brow. <laughs> me and Jimmy Anderson would have, yeah, we would have horrendous ones. So, I do do that, so, so that's a list, that is quite metrosexual. So you, you've made friends with the tweezers. Yeah, my so. girlfriend normally does it for me, so I can't, so I think she thinks that. But in terms of moisturiser, I'm sorry, I, I brush my teeth, wash my face with water and go to bed, so not that stuff, but my eyebrows <laughs> do need special treatment. <laughs> I think it fits in really well with what I believe in. I'm very, I'm very proud to be English, very proud to be British, and to be associated with a British, uh, an English band. I think all my other sponsors as well are British and English and quintessentially English as well. So, you know, my, I'm very much country boy. I'm into my farming, and and that just suits the brand suits me, and I think I suit them right.